Hello everyone, my name is Vishwajit and I'm finally back with the LLM search tool powered by and web scrapper. I have made this repository open source in my local GitHub. I'll share the link at the end of this video. And uh, this is, I have uh, open source under Apache 2.0 license. So feel free to take it and use it. As I told you all, this, this works in both modes. One is the local mode, like use local LLM when once clicked. You can select the locally running this. You can pass your LLM. You can set the temperature and ask the question. But uh, because my laptop is a little bit slower, it's a Windows laptop. So local LLMs are not that working that good. So let's uh, take an example uh, with an open AI key. Now I'm going to ask it. I have made a little bit of a change for this demo. What I did, I changed the number of uh, URLs we are fetching. So rather than fetching five, which was happening earlier, you can see I have, I have taken only two. I will show you and walk you guys through an example where it took the five uh, search results, five URLs and uh, summarize them. Uh, right now, let me ask it something that is very, very good and very latest. Tell me about US elect elections uh, in 2020. Uh, let me add it in October 2024. Right, let me correct this no in okay just this much is enough and let's hit the search and as i had told you guys earlier right when we hit search it will generate um, a query it will right now you can see it searched the duck duck go it got top two urls earlier it got two because i had set this number to five that's why it got five now i have set it to two so it's taking only two for the demo purpose, I have set it to two. You can set it to as much as, as you want. And then uh, what it will do, I have a locally running uh, in my uh, Docker. I have a locally running scraper. It is going to use that particular API. It's going to scrape those URL, take the markdown content of that URL, send back to the summarizer, which again uses OpenAI's API key for now. Summarizer will summarize that website data and keep only the required or the very important points of this. Then those summarized URLs will be passed to again an LLM. Uh, that's again uh, OpenAI's LLM, uh, the GPT-40 uh, mini in this case, with the original question, and we will see the answer. Till this answer is generating, let me walk you through a previous answer which I, uh, which I got. So here you can see it uh, uh, found the five sources. It uh, analyzed this five, uh, you know, five source uh, sources URL. The total time it took was uh, uh, 136 seconds. Uh, yeah, it is quite a lot, right? You can see also this original query was this, then optimized search queries like this. It found the URL, it summarized this, and this is for all of them, right? You can see it has done it for all of them, right? It is so good. And then if you took a look at the final answer, let's go to the question. Question was latest news in AI ML October 2024. And the final answer is in October 2024, several significant developments, the limitation of LLM's reasoning, IBM's Granite 3.0 launch. This is good. And then Lattice Flow's compliance framework. I was not even aware about this. Advancements in uh, LLM. See, you can see it's uh, telling, talking about November 2024, right? And so much, right? And uh, see, our, uh, our, uh, our answer is generated. Let's take a look at this. So original query was, tell me about US election in October 2024. US election October 2024 overview and the key details. It got two links. Let's click on the summary, right? It uh, it gave us a summary. That's good. I think this one did not work. Again, it's work in progress. And it's giving an answer. In October 2024, the United States is preparing for the presidential election which will take place on november 5 which is already done right we need to we specifically asked for october that's why it told us that news if we would have asked about the latest news uh, it would have given us the same now the code for this repository is totally open source go ahead play with it don't forget to star it and uh, i haven't added any any development or uh, collaboration this because it, this is a very uh, very simple simple app i have added some good screenshots you can go through them as well and uh, i will be definitely soon open sourcing my web scrapper api i'm just adding some fine tuning inside it once that is done 
I'll be making sure that I share an open source version library of that that code so all of you can access it and collaborate uh, in it with me. I hope all of you enjoyed this and stay tuned for more AI news. Thank you so much.